Georgia, come down to the front. If you are not a registered voter in the state of Georgia, get up out of the seats in the front. Let my fellow Georgians come down to the front and have those seats. I know I'm late, Georgians, but I'm here to remind you that today is voting day here in Georgia. Please get out and make your voices heard. My peeps down in Fulton County, our girl Fannie Willis is on the ballot. Get out and get her back in office. I saw her campaign ad on Political Sis's page not too long ago. It's powerful. I want to share it with y'all. Every time I walk into a courtroom, I am underestimated. But that can be a powerful thing. They never see it coming. Four years ago, when I took office, crime in Fulton County was out of control. There had been a gang war going on for years. When George Floyd was murdered, that was a disgusting tragedy after so many other disgusting tragedies. Community trust with law enforcement was broken. The district attorney's office was completely broken. No justice! At every angle, there were problems. Hands up! Hands up! Hands up! My father lived through many atrocities in the civil rights movement. There was actually a sit-in protest while they were sitting at that counter, a white man spat on him. He spit right on top of my head, and I could feel the tobacco juice just dripping down the side of my face, and I was just so enraged. That man was offended by African Americans being treated equally and having the right to vote. I stand here on the shoulders of great people. My father and others, they fought, and some died for the right to vote. Being born into the movement taught me some real core values. Everybody is entitled to some dignity. What we are doing is a balanced approach. We are prosecuting the most violent criminals while making sure that we save children and we give first-time offenders a second chance. I've launched a number of programs that help children and adults. If I can solve crime by seeing children in the classroom and not the courtroom, then that is a great success. I'm unapologetic about going after gangs very vigorously to remove them from our community. Honey Willis cracks down on gangs and drugs. Homicides are down more than 21%. Violent crime is down more than 25%. We have the third largest crime drop in America. People deserve to live free from crime. Women pushed around too long deserve to be free from fear. It is very important to me to defend every citizen of Fulton County's civil rights and their right to be safe. It doesn't matter to me how violent you are. I am not going to back down from prosecuting those that are wealthy or powerful. As all the attacks come at me, they don't understand what I'm built from, what fire I come from. I'm Fonnie Willis. Like I said before, I am always underestimated, but that can be a powerful thing. How powerful? If you break the law in Fulton County, you will be brought to justice. There are a lot of people out there that had never heard of Fonnie Willis. The first time of them hearing about Fonnie Willis is because of Donald Trump and his co-defendants. Fonnie Willis is more than the Donald Trump trial. She has done so much more for the city of Atlanta, Fulton County, than arresting Donald Trump. She has been an active member of that community for years. Look up her record. See what she's done. Again, she is more. She has done more than what she is doing with this Donald Trump trial. And because of this Donald Trump trial, racist white people in this state want to get rid of her. They don't think about what she has done 
for the community. And because of what she has done for the community, it is the very reason, Fulton County residents, you need to get out and cast your vote. They are trying to get rid of a positive community member, a community member who has done so much and has given so much for our community. She has given up so much to make sure that the powerful, the corrupt, powerful individuals associated with Donald Trump face justice. They tried to steal our vote. I hope y'all will get out and back her. I hope y'all will do that. She's put everything on the line for our community and for doing what's right. I hope y'all will get out and show her some love in return.